A super quick 10 second story. A couple years ago, we're in a production meeting with Julio Jones, who's a really nice guy, wide receiver for the Falcons. Very soft spoken, and we're talking. And finally, Pam says, Julio, are you the best receiver in the league or what? And he says, yes, Miss Oliver, yes, Miss Oliver. <laughs> there isn't a player, coach, front office member, broadcaster in the league that doesn't respect Pam, and I am certainly one of them. She's a trailblazer, an icon. I'm lucky to call her my teammate and my friend. Ladies and gentlemen, a special honor for me to present the Gracie Award for Best On-Air Talent, Entertainment and Sports, Pam Oliver. <laughs> Y'all had a good day. I had an opportunity to talk to a lot of media leaving, leading up to tonight about what it is I do uh, and how much I love it. There are two common denominators relating to how I was raised and my passion. One was sports and the other was journalism. One of my favorite questions is, what can you teach young girls who want to do what you do? And my thing is always, first and foremost, you have to protect your dream. There are gonna be people who tell you all the time, you're a woman, you can't cover sports, you probably don't even know about sports. There's nothing ever been gender specific about covering football, but a lot of people haven't gotten that memo. <laughs> I have been called a bitch at least on three occasions by head coaches, but never to my face. It was always as I was walking away. Because if you ever said it to my face, it would be on. <laughs> but because you never get anywhere by yourself, um, I am so thankful to my Fox family, the rowdy ones at Table 19, <laughs> for giving me more than 20 years of opportunities to cover something that I really love and to just be able to grow and, as Kevin talked about, establish all these relationships with people around the NFL and around the country. I also want to thank my family and friends, the Rowdy Ones at Table 12, for all of your love and support. But I'd like to dedicate this to my family, my parents who are up in heaven, John and Mary, uh, again, probably talking about how proud they are of their daughter and that has given me wings for so many years. Thank you all. Yeah.